the sustainability space, it's a, I think it's a really exciting time for us specifically because it's gotten over the hurdle of like, oh, is this a viable career path? Like, are people actually gonna continue investing in this area and continue to focus on this area? But we're also at a time where it's not yet so mature that it's difficult to break into in a way, or it's like a very set specific path that you need to follow. So it's it's like we're in a very nice middle ground at the moment of we know it's an established and viable career path, but we also have the freedom to be able to come to it from very different backgrounds and bring very different skill sets and still be able to pivot into that space if we want to. And so it's no longer the case necessarily that you can just be like the sustainability expert. It's more that you have to combine that with a function. So you need to be the sustainable operations expert or the sustainable marketing expert. Um, or the sustainable finance expert. And so I think in terms of self-assessment, it's really important to not only marry your area of interest, um, but also really think critically about the skills that you bring to the table and the exposure that you've already had. So me coming from a marketing and advertising background, it's probably a very natural fit that maybe I'll end up in some kind of marketing role for a sustainable driven company or be a specialist in how to market sustainable products. I kind of, for me, consulting was a way of continuing to explore that and really making sure that marketing is the path that I want to continue down. Um, but I think that self-assessment should should really pair the two. Um, and so students who are coming to Columbia, yes, I think it's really great to have an idea of, you don't need to know exactly the specific area you want to go into, but at least have it narrowed down to maybe two or three. Um, because like with everything in the MBA, it can become overwhelming very quickly. Um, and I think having a very narrowed search helps students um, fundamentally not be overwhelmed, but also really prioritize the initiatives that they're getting involved with on campus and then the people that they're meeting and kind of speaking to about recruitment off campus as well. 